significant brain injury, and there were signs of, of possibly ongoing child abuse with the child. Based on that information, we were not able to actually look at the child. We we're not able to, to interview the, the child. Uh, the child was in, in very grave condition, and it was flown immediately to Lamonger. But speaking with the uh, the medical staff, uh, we knew the severity of, of his injuries, and uh, we knew how gravely he was injured. So we we immediately interviewed both parents uh, at that time at our emergency room here in Selmer, and uh, a decision was made at that point that both of the parents would be, or actually the, the father and his girlfriend would be placed in custody. That, ar that initial arrest was based on the fact that Mr. Dilworth had an outstanding warrant for him in Shelby County, and uh, 